Hello guys, what is up? In this video, we are going to show you how to use Outlier AI and how to apply for a job position in working with artificial intelligence. Now, of course, you need to go to outlierai.com, which is this website, as you can see here, shape the next generation of artificial intelligence with your expertise. Get paid training, cutting edge AI on your own schedule, right? It says here, there are over 40,000 experts 3.4 million app assignments and a hundred million payout, which is very enticing for a lot of people. Now, you need to understand that you don't need to be an expert or art on artificial intelligence, nor do you need to have experience working with artificial intelligence uh, to actually apply because they don't need specifically experts on AI. They need experts, period. So they need experts on different fields to help train AI on specific on those specific fields or specializations, right? <laughs> so as you can see here, share your expertise and get paid working where and when you want. Share your knowledge. Everyone, everyone is an expert at something. Share your expertise and help make AI more human, which is what I just said a few seconds ago. Connect with fellow experts. Uh, they use Slack uh, <clears throat> with their community, with communicating and talking with each other, and then get paid on your own terms and competitive pay while enjoying the flexibility to work where and when you want. So as you can see here, this is pretty much where <clears throat> they're going to go. So there are a few uh, kind of like subcategories like generalist, math, chemistry, law, history, coding, data science. <clears throat> certain job posts want certain specialists, right? So if you're a chemist, if you're a lawyer or you work at law, if you, if you do coding, if you work with data science or if you're a mathematician uh, or just any, 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 any trade, to be honest, <clears throat> you will, you will need to do that. So again, it's, it's like job, uh, online jobs, ph, as you can see here, this is like online jobs, like, uh, job board, uh, different types. As you can see here, Flutter developer, uh, different developers, <clears throat> they want, uh, marketing manager, <clears throat> 3D designer, a SEO specialist. So it's the same with this, uh, with, with Outlier. And the only difference is here you work directly with the client, right? Specifically for what they're looking for. So if you're an SEO manager, you're going to work with the client and and to improve their SEO or their search engine optimization with, with their either company or products or services, right? <clears throat> with Outlier, uh, you work with an AI, for example, you're a chemist, right? You're going to train a specific AI about your, your, your craft, right? About chemistry, pretty much, like, or whatever branch of chemistry you specialize in. Hmm. So that's the difference, right? Here you work directly with people or services. Here you work with those people and their AI, right? <coughs> so how do you start? Oh, by the way, another thing. This is not available for everybody. It is not available for me in my country. I'm in Southeast Asia. I'm in the Philippines. Uh, it is not available in the Philippines. So <clears throat> it's kind of a bummer because I cannot sign up or log in. So how do you sign up or log in? Very easy. Just click on login here on the upper right corner of your screen. When you go to outlier.com When you click on this, you're going to be brought to this page. Right? Very simple, very standard. Welcome to Outlier. If, you have, if you've already created an account, then you, you know what to do, right? But if you don't, if you want to sign up, if you want to register, click on sign up here on the very bottom, right? Click that. And then here, uh, outlier, join a revolution, fill in your education and work experience, verify your identity and phone number. Uh, so this looks, seems legit, right? Uh, pass a skill assessment to determine your fit, your fit for the projects that they are, you know, so that's pretty strenuous, right? So create an account. I agree, right? Do that. And then uh, click sign up, whatever, right? And as you can see here, you can choose your Google account. <clears throat> and of course, it's blurred because privacy. Uh, <clears throat> and it doesn't work for me because, again, uh, if I do this, as you can see here, notice you already have a remote task. Uh, even if I bypass this, it's going to say that, oh, you can't. You can't because your country is not, it's not available in your country. So again, that's the thing. Now, once you have done 
um, <clears throat> signing up, right? And you've confirmed everything, you passed the assessment, you gave them your um, formal uh, professional identification. <clears throat> you wrote to this page again, and you can click either view opportunities here on the upper right again, or you go to here, join a community of innovators. For example, if you want to do <clears throat> uh, coding, click on coding, right? And you're going to be brought to the coders, right? Coders. Um, hmm. And sometimes if there are no available job posts for, say, here, if I click on history, they're still available, right? So there you go. <clears throat> so you just need to look for specialization. You can just click here and search key for keywords. So as you can see here, if you want to type writer, there you go. And these are going to be writing coach, uh, evaluator and trainer. So different types of writers and so languages as well. Um, you can train AI to your specific language or dialect. So it's here, Bengali, Finnish, German, Polish, um, <clears throat> Arabic. Uh, South Africa, Afrikaans, Armenian, Aziri, Bengali, uh, Danish, Dutch, Estonian, Farsi, French, French Canadian. So, yeah, so you can just search for keywords of your like chemist or whatever, as, as you can see. Uh, and again, there at, at the uh, at this record as of this recording, there are only 137 jobs available, um, but there will be more. Right after that. Uh, let's say go to chemist, right? Let's just use it for this example. Chemistry expertise sought for AI training remote anywhere in the United States, Canada, Puerto Rico, Mexico, United Kingdom, Australia, New Zealand, and Argentina. So if you want to apply for this, simply click and you will be brought to this page. So it's pretty much the same as say if you click on uh, a job post, right? So this is the SEO that, that we used earlier. And as you can see here, key responsibilities, qualifications, skills, requirements, work details, uh, so and so forth. <clears throat> it's the same, right? Th for me, I feel like this is a bit more organized because uh, about the freelance, so about the opportunity, the services that you need to provide, uh, your required expertise, desirable expertise, and then the payment information. And then as you can see here, <clears throat> there's a wall of text that you need to really read properly uh and then if you desire if you decide to like okay i i actually want to apply for this scroll down a bit so type your first and last name <clears throat> type your email right so everything with an ask red asterisk is required right <clears throat> so first name last name email phone number and then your resume so whether you attach it here or you use dropbox or you, you use google drive or whatever and then uh <clears throat> link your link if you have a link you i would i would like to say that you do need linkedin profiles just in case because not every job post has this right but just in case it asks for your linkedin profile like this post just 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 be prepared for that and after that are you based in any of these following countries yes so like what we said earlier they wanted some they, they wanted uh advocates from these countries right so united states canada puerto rico mexico uk australia new zealand and argentina uh <clears throat> if you're one of those uh just click yes right just click yes are you authorized to work in the country you're currently living in just you know of course maybe and then education just put in like what your school what your degree is right so <clears throat> it's very simple and again this is very job posts vary so as you can see here it, it ends with education right uh but if you look at another um job post go to math this is probably going to be different right as you can see here you can see different school degree discipline start date right end of year whatever and then the information that you need to fill up is different like, like that, that's why i said that just prepare everything that you can possibly think of preparing so that if they ask for it you have you have something right and yeah once you once you fill up everything just click on submit application and you will be good to go you will probably hear some uh from somebody from whoever posted this 
uh, <clears throat> whether or not you pass the screening, the initial screening or not. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's our video. Hope you liked it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell. I'll see you on the next video.